The following tutorial is going to discuss how to join an Adobe Connect meeting online. After you've logged into your Moodle course, you should find in your course a link to an Adobe Connect meeting. In my case, in week one, I have week one online discussion using Adobe Connect. So I'm going to click on the link. After I click on the link, I will get a description of the meeting and then a link directly below that to the actual meeting itself. So go ahead and click on the link to open the meeting. When you get to the Adobe Connect login page, you're going to want to click on enter as a guest. Go ahead and put your first name, last name, and then click on enter room. You are now in the Adobe Connect meeting. The first thing that you're going to want to do when you enter your very first meeting is make sure that you set up your audio correctly. To do this, in the upper left hand corner, click on Meeting and go to Audio Setup Wizard. You should get an Audio Setup Wizard dialog box. Go ahead and click Next. You'll want to play the sound at this point to make sure that your speakers are working properly. If they are, go ahead and click Next. And at this point, you want to choose the microphone that you're going to be using while using Adobe Connect. If you have a headset, a USB headset installed, you'll want to choose that device. So I'm going to, in the drop down, choose my USB device that I have. In most cases, you should only see one or two choices. I'm going to click Next. At this point, you can click on the record button. Go ahead and click on allow. And then you can test out whether or not the device is working properly. This is going to record everything that you are saying into the device. I'll go ahead and click on stop. And now you can play the recording to make sure that everything is working properly. If that is working properly, click on next. The next item is to tune the silence level to detect the amount of background noise around you. Go ahead and try to be in a quiet place and click on test silence. You'll want to wait for the bar to progress to the very end. It'll tell you that the test is complete and we can click next. Your audio setup is successful. Go ahead and click finish. Now that your audio is set up, you can now participate completely with your Adobe Connect meeting. Some other items for your meeting in the lower right hand corner, there is a chat box. So you can actually type a question and have that appear to everybody in the class. At the top, there's a little figure of a person with a hand raised. You can click on the drop down next to that and it does give you a few options in here. These are just little icons that will appear to the right of your name under the participants list. So if you need to get the attention of the instructor, you can actually raise your hand. So if you click on raise hand, you'll now see over under the participants list an icon with a hand raised to the right of your name. The instructor will get a pop-up box on their screen stating that the person has raised their hand and they'll be able to actually address you as a participant in the meeting. If you have additional questions or need addition if you have questions or need additional training, please contact Samuel Williams, the Academic Technology Specialist and Trainer at WILLIASA at UP.edu.